in a minute can has five tips for bachelor spring training. Yeah, it's time for uh, spring cleaning, trying to get everything cleaned up. And for some reason, especially for young men who live on their own or maybe with other men as roommates, they have a hard time getting into the swing of things of cleaning up the house. So today, five tips to help bachelors, single men that live it on their own, get things cleaned up. All right, first thing you want to do, look, you need to set aside some time for this. It's going to take you at least two days. So set aside two days to get everything clean. Maybe one day you're just kind of like getting rid of or moving around the big stuff, and then the second day you start to really get into the corners and get in the bathroom and the kitchen, things like that clean. But you're going to need to set time aside. You can't get it all done in one day, that's for sure. Once you've set aside two days and you know this is coming up, you got to get reinforcements, people. Stock up on supplies. There's nothing worse than getting into that second day of cleaning and realize you don't have supplies that you need. Now you have to stop everything, go to the store, and can buy new cleaning supplies. That sets you back, and then you sometimes kind of lose your enthusiasm for the job after you've gone to the store to get stuff. So you don't want to have that. Get your supplies first so you can start this job and get it done in those two days. All right, after that, start thinking about removing and replacing old stuff. Maybe you've got an old chair that's been in there for a while. You're doing some spring cleaning. Realize, you know what? We don't need this chair anymore. So when you do remove that, think about replacing it. And if you think about replacing it, remember the spot that you moved that piece of furniture from Take the measurements from that spot and then go try to find another piece that will fit that particular spot. Or maybe you can just redo the whole room in entirely. But think about removing and replacing old furniture on this particular day. And then once you do that, you got to call ahead for removal. We talked about this about two weeks ago. If you're trying to get rid of like big items like furniture and things you're not using anymore, you can call the sanitation department. And for an extra fee, they will come pick that up. If they can't do it, you can also call Goodwill, and you can also list it on Craigslist or list it on Facebook, and somebody will pick that thing up for sure. But make sure you make plans ahead of time so that's not sitting out front of your home for more than three days, because that is, as folks would say, it's untoward behavior. And the last thing you want to think about, you got to find a way to get through this, right? Make a playlist. Turn this into something fun. Make sure you've got music going and something that stimulates you and keeps you going for the two days because everybody knows that cleaning the house is kind of tedious and it's kind of boring. But if you stick to these tips, you'll get done in two days, you'll be in a good mood, and your house is going to be perfect when you're done. That's five tips for bachelor spring cleaning. To find out more, go to gooddaysacramento.com. Click on show info for today's date. And man up for getting it all done in two days and feeling good about yourself. Who is the standing by? What's the